showdown. No denying this man's striking credentials. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kick. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he eyes very well as he follows with a jab right hand, left hook. High kick comes over the top, and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it. He will try to put on a striking clinic once again here tonight. Not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. More than five years apart. Some differences in height and reach as well. Here once more is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 194 pounds. Diesel! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your So here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their goals? What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Trying to establish that jab once again. Big shot lands. Right hand landed. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. As he gets close and he's out of the kicking range, he'll suddenly he'll change his stance. Big kick lands. Oh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Lee. Unable to connect with the right. 
very tricky when he throws that body kick. Nice straight punch. Oh, bone on bone, shin slash foot right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator and not a fighter? You see why? Yeah, those are fun. I'm telling you, man, you get kicked in the head a lot of times at the end of the night. Got a little experience with that. Yes, I do. Horrible. Let's get going now. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Good punch. He loaded up there on that high kick. Try to establish that jab. And he landed the right hand there. Big call for first man. Now he gets back to range. Visibly limping here. Nice jab by him there, and that's gonna give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Oh, he heard a bell of the jab. Horn sound for the end of round one. I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. Ready? Ready? All right, second round underway. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Beautiful head kick. Can't take many of those, you better check. There's the jab, now another for good measure. Nice job there by Lee. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. He's throwing bombs. Every time they come into contact, he is throwing bombs. Ooh, we what a right hand by this young man. Oh, nice job to land a knee to the body, man. I wish I was that tall. Oh, massive kick to the body. Oh, oh, nice knee. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. That one's not good. Nice strike. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block. Oh, good shot right on the line. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Take your time, relax. Good stick. Nice head kick. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. And that one certainly found the target. I don't know how many times he hit in the head and stay in this fight. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Good 
good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Left-right combo is good. Nice punch lands over the top. Liver kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Take a look back at some of the highlights from that last round, DC. A lot for the replay guys to choose from. I mean, these guys are going to be very busy trying to find what replay to show you guys. Lance on both sides of the octagon. Both guys fought great. What a phenomenal round. Tonight he's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Real quick leg kick. He comes knee. through with a big knee. That knee hurt him. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time. He's a in there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know what to do. Run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Nice body kick. Nice move. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Once again, making good use of his size as he lands the knee. Well, he has really started to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Single collar tie there. Kick to the body by Lee. Nice strike. His misses are entertaining. Thirty seconds now to go in the round. Seconds left. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. You ready? You ready? Fourth round now, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. We'll see if he can finish. What a punch. Went for the inside leg kick. 
Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block! Just misses with the jab. What a tricky head kick. Leg kick. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh! He's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming so just the way he drew it up exactly what he told us during fight week played out here on fight night he found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine is called to stop for this contest at two minutes, 55 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Diesel. And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoyed the first thing your kids, right? Yeah. But you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even...